few vaccinations I'd like to talk to you about. Uh, the first one is the whooping cough vaccination. Um, it's also referred to as pertussis. And we mm. invite our uh, pregnant ladies to have the vaccine between 16 and 36 weeks. Uh, the reason why we advise this is because whooping cough can be a serious uh, medical problem for the newborn. And if the mum gets the vaccine during those weeks, she makes a special uh, product in her body called antibodies and they transfer it from the mum through the placenta to the baby. And so the baby has protection against whooping cough for the first few weeks of his or her life until he or she can go ahead and get vaccinated. So I'd like to talk to you also about the flu vaccine. I'm sure you've heard about it. Yes. Um, we advise uh, any of our pregnant ladies to come in and uh, talk to us about the flu vaccine because uh, like other vaccines, the mo mother-to-be makes antibodies for, against the flu virus and this is trans these are transferred to the baby through the placenta. And so the baby gets uh, immunity from the flu, the main flu viruses for the first six months of his or her life. If the baby gets the flu when he or she is very young, it can be a very serious uh, problem for the baby. Also, if the mum gets the flu during her pregnancy, particularly towards the middle to the end of her pregnancy, it can be very difficult for her to fight it. And very often, mum would, would end up having to go into hospital to have treatment. So rubella is another vaccine that is worth talking about. Uh, it is a vaccination against the condition known as German measles. And German measles uh, to, to the unborn can be a very serious condition and can affect various things such as sight, uh, brain function and lungs. So we would advise most we would advise our ladies if they have been vaccinated for against rubella through the MMR vaccine, they would have a great chance of being immune to this already. However, if they're unsure if they've had the vaccine already, they can come and talk to us and we can uh, ask the laboratory to check their blood for immunity. If the lady isn't immune, we can offer a vaccination, but we would advise her not to become pregnant for a month uh, after that vaccination. If we discover that you are, are, have low immunity during your pregnancy, we would advise you to become vaccinated afterwards. Mm -hmm.